Hello and welcome to something I want to do. Um, don't think these are supposed to be here. Right, now that we've got that sorted, welcome to State of Decay 2 completely vanilla lethal zone. This is something I have not done much of uh, in the way of pure vanilla. I usually play the game modded. Um, so, you know, sometimes I like it to be very simple. I like to keep things easy, you know. Um, <laughs> saying that, I am I'm going to do something else that I don't normally do, which is start a community with uh, all legacy survivors. Now, my reasoning behind this is because, you know, given my nature, I tend to sort of fizzle out from series occasionally, and um, I thought, you know, to, to give this series a really good chance of, of, uh, of being completed, let's give ourselves a little bit of a head start with um, some legacy survivors who are going to start off, you know, a little bit more advanced and maybe just get us through the series a little bit quicker. That's the, the only reason. Now, I am going to use Google to... Uh, I'm going to use this new AI that's taking over the world to select three of our survivors. So please give me... What have we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so give me a second. Okay, our AI overlord chose Gary, who is uh, an expert in construction, Lissa, who is an auto mechanic, and Val, who likes music, I guess. Um... I mean, I don't think we have anything too significant in terms of what are these called? Traits? But here's the gear that they come with. Crossbow, he's got quite a few sort of gardening or a gardening thing, some chemicals. Not Nothing <laughs> excellent, actually. Um, but, you know, that's what he... That's what we chose. Uh, this one, Lissa. So she's got quite... Very decent um, gun, actually. Three play cures. Uh, she, it's great that she's an auto mechanic, and we've got an advanced toolkit straight away. And a couple of decent weapons, some fuel. So, you know, she's not terrible. Some Molotovs to get us rocking and rolling. And Val, who's going to be uh, giving us some materials. And RTX Stormbringer, and an RTX Wolverine, and another play cure. And some 7.62 rounds, which is for that. Great. A non-compliant SKS, that's brilliant. And an RTX Rampart. All right, let's rock and roll. It's been a while since I started a fresh community, actually. I've been playing a lot of the Walking Dead mod, and yes, we will be continuing with the Walking Dead series. Uh, and what's this? Mega Valley, yeah. I think. So whose turn is it to find more fuel? Hours, just hours uh, in general. Last time I accidentally riled up a damn horde. Anyway, yes, great. I have a so we should. Is this microphone too close to my gob? I hope not. Maybe it is a little bit. Okay, let's see. Straight away. Let's get this fixed up and refueled. Yeah, totally vanilla. Uh, I mean, I've played like mostly vanilla. One of the things I tend to always play with is the car features from Dark Side. Um, the dark side mod because they're just so amazing. All right, just jump in. But uh, yeah, totally vanilla, fully lethal. This is going to be interesting. It's been a little while since I played some State of the K2. Not not too long. I don't know, a week or so. Is that a blood feral? Yes, it is. It's going to be the first thing for us to address, I suppose. Can't let that feral get too close. Oh, wow. Yeah, the, the, the vehicles are very different, aren't they? Oh, no. Okay, here we go. Here we go, guys. Are you ready for this? Get ready. I'm not I'm not amazing at this game, and it's been a while since I played it. But, you know, I remember that that's a half, uh, a half reliable way of dealing with ferals. Okay. We should be okay here. Didn't realize I had ammo. I would have shot that feral. I'm I'd here. known that. Time for me to get to work. So what have we got here? We are traveling heavy. We've got a metal bat. We should be fine to deal with this. So literally, absolutely no mods at all. All vanilla. 
functions. A bit of a fixer upper, but this place Vanilla mechanics. Oh, there's something about this game. I've said I know I've said this before. It's just uh there's just something about it. It's a bit magical, you know? It is, it's a bit magic this game. It's hard to get away from, that's for one thing. It's hard to get away from for an extended period of time. Just always draws you back in. You know? Something about it. I'll tell you what. It's gonna be nice not playing with my like, insta-kill bite mechanics and stuff like that. You know, and just kind of knowing knowing a lot more about what we've got to deal with uh, in, in the sense of like all the freaks are normal and the missions are normal time of day is normal there's no pitch black nights so you know it's it's good it's good news all around i feel the coast isn't clear typical oh yeah i forget this uh sometimes has things, doesn't it? Has things inside it. Is that a juggernaut? Oh fuck. Um Yeah, I just heard a juggernaut. Brainless are gone, so it's time for us to claim this place and move in. Sound like maybe it could have been far away. All right, let's get this. Uh, let's get everything sorted. Each, all right. Juggernaut gave me a bit of a startled me a little bit. It startled me, just a touch. Thought it was coming in. You know what I mean? Uninvited. Thought it was coming in uninvited. I did. Now, all right. <laughs> buttons, buttons. What do I just? Yeah, this buttons. Okay, keys and buttons. Uh, I'll remember these eventually. Now, we're on lethal zone. This is one thing I've got to get in my head. Is don't rush. I'm always rushing. I'm always just rushing into things and not... I often don't so gross. give this game the respect that it deserves. Or at least this mode. You know, I spent... I don't know how long, but a long time playing this game on Dread Zone. And it was great. It was so fun. It was a challenge. You know, it was difficult at times. And, uh, right. Things are underway. it was just fun. Real fun. This one's done. And then, What's next? you know, as you do, uh, I decided to try Nightmare. It wasn't fun anymore. <laughs> It was fucking painful. It hurt. It hurt a lot. And then, you know, as you do, I decided to try. Well, no, I think I completed Nightmare Zone. Did I? Yeah, I think I did. I did. I I completed a legacy on Nightmare and then obviously evolved up to lethal. And the game hasn't been fun since I started playing Nightmare. And it's that's not completely true, but it's just it's it's more fun combined with immense stress. Although that's probably something to do with me and maybe not so much the game. Anyway, sort of yeah, rambling heavy. here. Let's get this stuff deposited and then we'll figure out where we need to be. What we need to be doing. Another perfect supply run by me. It's super fluid, isn't it? The game, it's just fluid. It's fluid and flowing. Oh, where did he go, man? What are you doing, bro? What are you doing just leaving me like this? Oh, yeah. We should be doing stuff, shouldn't we? That's right. There's things to be done. I'm glad we've Let's already get that got a going. start on building this base up into something real. Um, what was I looking for? One of them. I think I was looking for you. Hey, we need a hand over here. Oh, maybe. Strength in numbers, right? Yeah, I wasn't looking for him. Never mind. Found who I was looking for anyway. Away, whether you like me or not. Don't worry, man. You're safe. You're I was just trying to find you. 
Did he have a thing? No, he didn't, did he? He didn't. Okay, let's cancel his exile before he gets moody. I don't know if he does. <laughs> if this were easy, it wouldn't be so much fun. I don't think he does. Uh, cancel exile. All right, we're good. Now, have we got all the gear we need for now? 31 rounds should be good. Although, somebody has a crossbow. Nothing like a job well done. Crossbows are great, aren't they? Especially on lethal zone. Eleven rounds. That should be enough. I could take a sidearm. For security reasons, you know how that works. Ferals, really, just ferals. Sometimes screamers. Cray. Cray? Cray? Oh, Cray? All right, we'll say... We'll try that again. Great and okay at the same time. Oh, Cray? Let us see. Terrible townsfolk. I don't like the... Why don't I like the sound of them? Something about them, isn't there? I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's something to do with their name. Terrible townsfolk. It's odd to get a group with a bad name. Sometimes the, the names indicate the sort of temperament of the group, don't they? But it's odd to get one with a bad name to start off with. Although, I did once get a group. This is not a joke. I have mentioned this before. I don't think it was modded. I really don't think it was modded. Uh, they were called the Farts in the Wind. And they turned out to be one of those basically troll communities where you give them loads of rucksacks and they still don't give you anything. You know? I basically started calling them smells like blood. Troll communities. Better watch out for plague zombies. Let's uh still a bit of scav uh, scouting. I did not Although, know what makes plague terrible. We don't really need to do bad. this. This is the map that I know the best, but you know, we're here now. Look at that. More survivors. Yay. Is there one more? There is somewhere. Okay, nothing more to see here. So this girl was a leader, I think. I, I usually see how she's got the black outfit on. Black military outfit. I usually dress my leader in that clothing and my subordinates, my minions, in uh, sort of regular military outfits. I stopped doing that. I kind of did that with like my first seven, six, seven communities, something like that, five. And then I kind of stopped, started giving them a bit more character. I was in the whole like uh, sort of black ops um, you know, sort of SAS mind set or something. You know, I think you know what I'm trying to say. It's very dark in here. It's so nice not having to dodge from every bite, really. It's, you just, you wouldn't, you wouldn't believe how nice it feels. To be able to just play this game and not worry about dying from every encounter. This might be useful. Emphasis on night. I don't know. It's just it sort of blows me away. I'm so used to playing this game under immense stress. This feels nice. Blech, boring. Although I can already feel myself wanting to install the mod that speeds up this. Um scroll well, wheel we whatever, you, we whatever you call find. it but i won't do that what i might do though is get this outpost that's one more outpost ready to go and if we want we could spend some time you know, and make it even better food uh yeah food income is fun okay no zeds around but we can't secure the place with a play card close by so what I was trying to get at with the whole dread zone thing is I feel like I'm still on dread zone mentally. You know, I don't think I think I don't think and I think 
See how my brain works sometimes? It, it likes to have multiple thoughts at the same time. But my, wor my words, my mouth, can only speak one word at a time. So, it's a problem. Why do I even get my hopes up? Sometimes. Now, let me try and remember what I was going to say. I don't think... My brain is on lethal. Because I think the stress of Nightmare Zone was so intense that it actually traumatized my brain. And my brain tried to go backwards in time, back backwards to a safe space, you know? Like Dread. It tried to go back to Dread Zone. And it still wants to be on Dread Zone. But it's like, no. Y you're not allowed. Stay here with me and suffer, you know? You can't leave me here alone. <laughs> You must stay with me here in the torture. Yeah? Anyway. This is the sort of thing I torture myself about it. Midnight. Well, hello there, Mr. Screamer. It's nice to meet you. Enjoy peace eternal, asshole. It's nice to meet you on Lethal Zone. It's been a while. Been playing on a on a zone with no screamers. It's a little bit dark. Can I, can I do a thing? No, it's just not going to be on the audio, is it? Like gamma? Yeah, here we go. I don't know why this monitor. I need a new monitor. I've had to do this on a lot of my games lately. Hopefully that doesn't make it like horrifically bright for you people watching at home. But uh, I kind of need to do it. Hey there. Our supply of plague samples has run low. Okay, it's just the classic. Hey, well, that's one thing I don't think we the best place to find them is had the many of our park. characters, did we? Didn't have any plague samples. I mean, honestly? Helping out like this is a good way to make friends. We could take on a plague heart right now. Let's I think. Hope this pays off. We could use allies out here. Uh, if we could see one. There's usually one over here. Where are we here? Yeah, isn't there usually one there? Wonderful smell we've discovered. I didn't bring a plague cure. That would have been smarter. Dear God, I'm tired. No, you're not. We got one plague sample. Like I said, I didn't bring a plague cure. Well, I didn't really expect to fight a plague heart, but you know, we're here. We got Molotovs. It's not like the plague heart regenerate or anything on this mode, you know? Or have stupendous health. Or spawn new plague hearts every day. Actually quite pleasant, isn't it, this lethal mode. I know I'm being facetious. It, it, obviously, it turns into absolute hell, and I'm aware of that, but you know. Nice for me to live in moments of delusion. Occasionally. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes you just, you just have to... Why did I only have one option? That's new. Okay, then I guess we're being resourceful. You know, sometimes you just have to leave people alone in their delusions. Ignorance is bliss. Nothing. What you think? What Sometimes, all the time, some most of the time. Anyway, okay. Well, that's 
Probably not great. Ooh, play sample. Done and done. Too easy. I don't think these uh, spawn ferals early, do they? These things. Never mind. That would be a feral. I mean, I was expecting that. The armor's gone. Although another one might prove a little bit tricky. Is that another feral? Sausage. Oh shit. Changes things up. A little bit. Gotta finish it. Alright. I do not want to know what makes plague territory smell this bad. See what I mean about... Okay, it's not that it's not fun. Because it is. It's just... Uh, in, in, in the same way that... No matter which... No matter what you think you're doing in this game. Your thoughts are interrupted constantly. This is... You know what this game is? Have you ever been in a relationship? And I hope you haven't. Because these aren't pleasant. It's not a pleasant situation to be in what I'm about to describe. Um, you know, if you have a partner or a friend or somebody in life, and no matter what you say, whatever you come up with, they they sort of negate it. Hey, a lot of stuff. that was my friend. Uh, they negate it. It's like you know, you, you say you want to go, you want to go to the movies on a Friday night, and they're like, yeah, nah, nah, we're not doing that this weekend because we've got to go and do something else. All right, okay. Or you know, do you want to? Like, should we have, like, chicken and rice for dinner? And they're like, no, no, I don't want chicken and rice. It's like, no matter what you come up with, in terms of a plan or a strategy or a way to deal with your life and not die, this game negates you every time. It devalues your input at all times, you know? It's like, no, I just want you to die. And you, you, you need to die more often. That's the game's... What the game wants for you. You know, you might want to have a good time and stay alive. But the game's like, no, you're not, you're not allowed. Here's a bloater. Here's a, here's, here's a triple feral pack. Look, you thought these people were your friends, did you? Well, <laughs> the game says no. Anyway, that's what this game is to be. And I can't get enough of it. 
Uh, it's like a bad one of those bad relationships, you know, like I'm hooked. Toxic. It's a toxic relationship. I should probably eat them painkillers, shouldn't I? Anyway, after all that... If you're in one of those relationships, by the way... Don't, don't stick around. They're not good. Deeply, deeply... Not good. Alright kids, here you go. Bundle of fuel cans of... Alrighty, I mean... I can make something that'll cure blood plague if one of us gets infected. 500 influence? Sure. We're happy I'll to share that. the recipe if you need it. So, I think I remember you Mr. Guru's... Mr. Guru has a rule. Right. See ya. Mr. Guru's rule is you always buy ammo. Guru's good at this game. I'm gonna build, I'm gonna trust him. Also like the look of that fuel bomb and those. So and a heavy weapon. We got a new development. We need a lot of materials if you want to build up this place. If you okay. say so. Is this the villager villager? Villager? No, not Builder and Pillager? No. Plunder and build? I don't know. It's called it's something to do with building materials. Build and pillage. I, I, I'm going to stop trying. Right. Loader. Beryl. See what I mean? Thought you had plans to go to the movies this night, tonight, this Friday night, did you? Nope. Not happening. It's not what I want to do. <laughs> and no matter, listen, no matter what. Mean. It's very mean. And I've, I've never played a game that threatened me. Emotionally. Spiritually. In such, a, in such a manner as this game. I've never played one. I don't think it exists. It might do. But I haven't discovered it. Ooh, wait. Vials of Plague Cure. That's a vial. That's a vial. They're all vials of Plague Cure. Are they not? Why don't they stack? And you only do they only stack in Hey wait, they've got a different got a different description. Isn't that interesting? Label do not eat. This one says a dose of homemade plague cure. I wonder if they're vile. Anyway, I'm gonna stop obsessing over the fact that one has an S in it and the other one doesn't. And we're gonna go and finish off that plague heart. This one needs to be repaired. We can't do because we don't have a workshop. Um, okay. Did we not have building materials or something like that? Or it got broke? How did that get broken? Because we ran out of materials. Oh, she. Ah, right. Don't think that's ever happened to me before. Or well, don't. I mean, yeah, repair it, I guess, but. We should go and get materials then. Really need someone in charge around here. Um, I agree. Can I have a look at your weapon? Hey, how's it going? What have you got there? It's not very... It's damaged, but it's not as damaged as ours. That's a lot of stuff. Okay, let's go and finish off this plague heart. Am I going to be able to get away with killing ferals? 30 rounds. Oh, this is a shotgun. Okay, sweet. Oh, this will definitely kill ferals easily. Okay, great. Let's go and do this plague heart. After we take some plague cure. So is that the only consequence for not having enough materials? As people get a little bit moody. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take another one. I think we'll be fine. Famous last words, and it is only round the corner. Um but I will I will use that. Actually, I'll use that.
How'd I get this job again? We need backup over here. Did I literally just run past this? I did, didn't I? Oops. How are we supposed to put up with this? Holy smokes. Wow, I don't have my uh, weapon equipped. Now I do. Alright, we're off to a little rocky start, but we'll get there. Barely hurting this thing. Please move. Can't keep this up. Yes, you can, love. Come on. I'll get you there, I promise. Don't shoot him. That's a feral. The armor's gone. I'm barely hurting this thing. It's hurting. Don't let up now. I don't have any more stamina items. Yay. Yeah, this is now where things get interesting. The armor's gone. It's not good shooting that thing around here at night time. Don't like that, getting caught on that thing there. It's not great. It's not my favorite thing in the world to do. All right. Come on then. Oh, wow. See what I mean about this game and how amazing it is and how much it loves me and appreciates everything that I do for it. Great, isn't it? I do not want to know what makes plague territory smell this bad. We'll come back in a minute. Didn't really have any intention of doing a plague heart. Like I say, it's just... It's happening, you know? Sometimes you gotta go with it. Here's what we'll do. We'll get her a little bit more gear. We'll head out okay, we're running on fumes here. and get some materials. We need, some more fuel. we need more materials, bro. That's a lot of stuff. That'll do. We're fine. We're fine. How about you get some Everyone's panicking. literally materials here anyway. Everyone settle down. Oh, no. no way am I catching this blood plague bullshit. Nothing more to kill here. Well, it's not much. Not bad. Not so bad. did we not actually the group of dum -dums alive. get a... Uh, no, Maybe we didn't. you should just go ahead and get over yourself, huh? Carry started a fight because he's got low morale.
Shouldn't have any issues here now. It's fine. You do it. Okay, go for that one instead then. Okay. Now that I've got that out of my system. Gotta stop going that way. Alright. Okay, now we can slow down. I'm not intending to speed run this or anything. It just happened. Just... I don't know, it just happened. Sometimes you just gotta go with it. Alright, now, uh, we do have another mission. And I do kind of intend to hover around missions. Um, we're definitely not at a point where I want to go killing lots of play carts or anything. You know, I want to sort out our base, get some resources. And try not to die, which is the main key. The main, definitely the main ingredient in this cheesecake. Alright, it's the cheese. It's the cheese, okay? It's the cheese in the cake. Yay. Wow, okay. I actually shot it and it didn't flinch. I think. I think I shot it and it didn't flinch. Interesting. I'm going to watch that one back. Just to call it a bit late in its um, animation or something. Okay, well. Now is our... Um, is our facility building again? Yes, it is. Great. Okay, well, we're going to swap out to uh, whoever the one is. Whoever the one is, I am the one. Val. Take control of Val. And let's do that. Although, is he the moody one? Who's the moody one? Didn't he... Didn't he start an argument while he was away from the base? That's... That's impressive. He started an argument and he wasn't even at the base. Wow. Okay, he's... I don't know what he is, but that's interesting. Keybinds, please. You. Hey, don't worry. I got this. We could keep talking or we could just handle it. Moody, I tell you what. Going to do that, right? What is your deal, right. Gary? Why are you so... Moody. Well, he's a thrill seeker. He had a son. Kept a smartphone. Okay. Not nothing. Nothing obvious. Hmm. All right. So we've got some tools in the car. I really shouldn't do that because now I can't even remember what I left in the car. Meanwhile, I think that. Um. Backpack first. 
those, that and that. This thing full auto only. Yeah. All right. That should do. It's one thing I think they could work on is the uh, you know for what is it called State of Decay Three. You know, things like this when you're like looting a vehicle and you try and was it you try and do like you deposit something in here and then you try to run off the edge and it gets stuck a lot. It's basically it happens like all the time certain points um, the movement character movement it's great it's really great and really fluid but there are those moments like you know when you go to jump over a wall and you push a, push a zombie or kick them or something like that things like that would definitely do with a further refinement if you want to help these people don't screw around go in guns blazing I mean no so we're all just happy playing it you moody sausage. Well, it might just get us here Everyone alive. No point over it. Who says we have to, like, get anywhere? We're here. We're here. And we're happy about it, you know? Didn't you want to talk? I'm going to go and see. All this pussyfooting around is going to get us killed. Well... I mean, I don't know, you're both in a real mood right now. You need to reflect. Do some reflecting. Go and, go and ask yourself, why am I unhappy? Alright, and then when you get a real answer, let me know. In the meantime, I'm going to go and have a talk to our neighbours and see if they're alright. Maybe they need help. But I'm also... Rapes and bruises enabled. What does that even mean? And it doesn't sound good. Oh, minus two meds per day. Oh, is that what that's called? Okay, that's new. I've never ever noticed that before. Now, since how long? Since when did the interferon we do two a day? Is that normal? Maybe it is. I've never heard, I've never heard it called scrapes and bruises before. We're secure. Okay, so the plan. Are you ready? Just get resources, that's all it is. I know I set that up as if it was some sort of plan, but it's not. It's just do what you'd normally do when you start this game. Get resources and uh, complete missions. That's it. That's that's the plan. Same as it always is. Okay, sometimes it's kill play cards, but that's not the plan. Alright. Wow. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. I see. That's what we did that we forgot to do. That one and uh, you. Wow, really small trunk space, isn't it? In vanilla. Lota, don't ever try and pop those with your door. That's not smart. Right, let's go and have a look over here. I probably should be focused more on um, resources than missions, but better not screw around here if I want to avoid blood plague. You know, we could do a couple, do a couple missions, or one, or something. I think this is the one where you can just like ask for it back, anyway, isn't it? Bad news, folks. Try talking oh, yeah, cool. first. I'll be right behind you. This is not a good mission to... Uh, I mean, we're not in a good situation to be 
to be fighting like a hostile enclave or anything. So... Probably pretty clear which way this will go if that happens. I watch these people play this game sometimes. Everybody walks everywhere. I don't know how they do it. They just walk casually, slowly. I mean, I know their logic is that you your character gets Until tired that quickly. Heart, Why was there really flashing thing there? Okay, oh, I see. It's just the... Never mind. It's just the vehicle. Yeah, they just casually, like, stroll to places, you know? Watch. Like this. Like they just go like this. Slowly. It's weird. It's weird how they do that. Do I not have a weapon? I got nothing left. Just one left. Can't do it. Hmm. That's all I got. Fire in the hole. I want this fight, all right? I want this fight. You'll be fine. These fights are what I play this game for, man. I'm not too fussed about him, to be honest. You okay there, pal? He's dead. Okay, well that kind of changes things a little bit, maybe? They're not as distracted now, are they? So that's always helpful. When they are. Excuse me. Okay, so it actually didn't matter about that guy anyway. Suppose we got some gear off him then, do we? When we find where his dead body is? Sometimes you just want to fight, you know? Sometimes you just want to have a fight. That's the way it is. That's a lot Can't to always around. control how you feel. You just, like I say, sometimes you got to go with it, you know? I'll be honest. We could use this. There's moments like that that I play this game for. The combat's just fun. You know, when you've got a big group of enemies. Nope, nothing. You gotta enter into a bit of a very focused state of mind. Very, very or, or try to be very in touch with your uh you know, these things here. Your fingers. Your hand eye coordination. It's fun. Where's my box, people? Is it on to roof? No. Wasn't taunt roof. Someone already got this one. It's out the front then. Where for art thou? Hmm. 
I'm not leaving until I find my box. Could be something really important. Is it behind here? Wow. I'm 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 genuinely missing a box of some sort. Ah, wait. Found it. Lucian. Antagonists. Is that literally the name of their group? They are literally called the Antagonists. I mean, well. Okay, then. Uh, I'm not going to park there. Just in case I need a leg it, which is an English term. That means run away very fast. I was going to say run, run away very fastly, but run away very fast kind of covers it. Let's do some looting first, just in case they do turn hostile. So I don't know where. Uh, ah, okay, great. Um, I don't know. Put it this way: when I want to play Dead of Decay Two, uh, I'll be playing this for the time being, for a little bit, and I will carry on with the Walking Dead mod, even though everyone's dying. No spoilers there. It's Dead of Decay Two after all. We hand over the measure talk. We can forget this happened. Really though, really though. Really? 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 It's time for you to die! Do it. You gotta be fucking kidding me. We're missing someone. Wanna help find them? Oh no, not you two. Was that me making that noise? That's weird. Alright. I mean, doesn't this mission just complete if you drive away anyway? Or does it, like, cancel? Have they updated it now where you can't leave? Yeah. I mean... Well, I don't really want to abandon it. But do I have a choice? Right now? I don't have any weapons. Kind of don't really have a choice. Alright, well we got some free meds out of it. We don't get the influence, but... So what I was getting at is... Uh... Yeah, when I want to play Dead of Decay 2, I'll be jumping back into this lethal zone. Uh, I will be carrying on with the Walking Dead mod, for those of you who are enjoying that series. Or at least just watching that series. Um, yeah, we'll be carrying on with that. But sometimes, you know, I consider that, not sometimes, but I do consider that quite a high stress environment at times. That Walking Dead one bite kill situation. And uh, although this is also high stress, it's less high stress. So, yeah, I'm just saying. You know, maybe keep an eye out for upcoming videos if you want to see more of this. More Lethal Zone. And yeah, keep an eye out for the Walking Dead stuff. Okay. That's my last magazine. Guns are um, breaking down very quickly, aren't they? Really, just wandering through. With no, uh, no one bothering you.
one thing I'm going to do quite quickly is upgrade our infirmary. Um, although we can't do it yet, obviously. But uh, yeah, I'd like to get two beds in there. Hey, all these plague hearts aren't going to clear themselves out. Relax, people. All right. Tell you what, take this. That's a happy gun. This is a happy gun, ladies and gentlemen. This gun is always, always happy. Day or night, rain, shine, snow, that stuff. It's just, it's a happy gun. Get to bed, Val, would you? I think I'm going to take a sick day. Mm, didn't I? Okay. Never mind. I thought I chose Larissa. Oh, he's cool too. Does this have a suppressor on it? It does. Let's get that off. Um, get that on. Can't do it from in here. Oh, it doesn't need a silencer. Interesting. I'm only going to save the bullets for ferals, so that should be enough. I still can't do anything with this. Um, oh, I've already got one here. That's fine. Backpack, I suppose. Give them an ultralight. Them, them, and them. And I'm going to start taking one of these around. Nah, I'm not. I'm not. I've got two at home. It's fine. Okay, so... Now, now we will start playing the game properly. Um, I kind of rushed myself there. I just threw myself into the deep end. It's been a while. Jumped straight onto a plague heart. Not much has changed in here, has it? Can't be long now before the uh, the new new updates released. It's the end of this month, they said. They're thinking end of April. All right. So our plan when we return will be to do a bit more scouting close to home. We've got a gun shop down here. Normally, the first thing I do when I get in the base is go straight down here, get the guns, get the gear, then clear all this area here. But, you know, I got us I got us in a little bit of a situation. There's plenty of... Um, in fact, there's loads of materials on this map, isn't there? There's like two construction houses over here that have got two each in or something. There's just loads. There's some there, some there. And, uh... Yeah. Oh my goodness. Alright, yeah, they're still a thing, aren't they? God, I always install the mod that gets rid of these. It's just, it's just, they're just annoying. You've really got to stay on to them from day one, though, don't you? That's what it is. And it's a low one. We're going to go and deal with it right now. That's what we're going to do. I'm just going to... I'm just going to always deal with uh, infestations from the onset, from the outset, from the onset, whenever they arise, whenever we see one, we're going to address it, alright, early, so it just doesn't become horrendously frustrating, and it's not even that it gets frustrating, I just, I end up just ignoring them, and just, yeah, just as if they don't exist. Ugh, the air like I know they've blood. they've done a lot of work around them for the zombies. next update, so I do look forward to that. Getting those fixes There's in. No securing a place this close to a plague. Wow. Okay. Is this really interesting? A lot of places out here to uh, loot. Fun. Screamer's obviously inside that door there. Is that it? Do I need that, really? Well, I've got some seeds now, so. Yeah, let's just I'll tell you what, just leave that stuff. It's just basic stuff. We're only here to do this.
This is it, isn't it? This is the thing. I say this a lot, but yeah, you just end up wandering around. That'll teach me to move too fast. Wandering around looking for those last zombies. Well, obviously, once the update comes in, then it's, um, you know, you just kill the screamers. It's going to be a thousand times better. For, for players like me, anyway, who just really don't enjoy running around trying to kill those straggler zombies. Fine like this should keep the folks at home happy for a while. I don't care. I don't care at this point. I just want I want that. And I'll take all comers. Not very good at searching this guy, is he? We've got them all in the corner here. Alright, okay, okay, alright. Finally, we got there. And we picked up a little bit of gear here too. What else does this place place have? I think the one I got was out from around the back here, wasn't it? Mm, yeah, I got they don't you. stack. Yeah. Well, we might save this um, this other toolkit somewhere else since we're here. Yeah, people just casually walk to places, don't they? In this game, they do stuff slowly, normally. I can't carry that much. See this here? It's stuck on the corner of the car. Stuff like that. That's what I was referring to earlier. Oh, they stack in the vehicle. Interesting. I mean, fuel's great, isn't it? It's a great thing to get. Now the Zeds are joining the party. Tell you what, that's not bad either. A screamer over here somewhere, I think. I'm in a little bit of a pickle here because I can't pick up the crossbow bolts and the crossbow. Hell? That zombies seem to be moving in fast motion then. It's weird.
Okay. Now, I mean... To be honest, I think... Uh, I think these are a bit more important than the ethanol at this point. Alright, let's get out of here, guys. I got the fuel from out here, didn't I? Oh, it's a bloater. Gotta stay out of that cloud. It wasn't a scream, it was a bloater. Alright, let's go home. Try not to die from that bloater cloud. But at least it's popped. So we're not going to run over it. Right, we've got tons and tons of places to loot. We're going to slow the hell down when we come back. As best we can. Maybe that would help me, you know, if I didn't run everywhere. Alright, here's what we'll do. I like, to, I like to try things in life, you know. I like to experiment. I'm a bit of an experimenteur. Is that a thing? You know what I'm trying to say. Like an entrepreneur, but an experimenteur. Experimenteur. Um... <laughs> When we come back, I'm going to go real slow. Right, I'm going to try to play this game without making any progress on that little task? taking it to stupid levels. I'm just going to walk everywhere slowly any like this. Alright. I'm going to do what normal people do. And just chill. Well, we could use some fresh faces around here. I'm going to try and chill my best, okay? That's what we're going to do when I come back. Well, I don't know when that'll be. It'll be at some point. In time, it will. Um, take that. We should have just left them on. I'll use that again soon. This gun, we're trying to gonna we're, we're gonna going to try to keep in good shape. This thing as well. Probably benefit from a silencer on it, but um, that can be for Lisa. Lisa. Things would be going a hell of a lot smoother if people around here just got their act together. You should go and meditate outside in the garden, pal. That's a lot of stuff. I think you need it. I think you need to chill a little bit. All right. Is this really all full auto? Kiddos. What's it called? Non-compliant SKS. Interesting. I mean, I don't think I've ever had an SKS in a game that was full auto, or maybe I've just never used it as full auto. Maybe it's this particular brand, uh, mo model, non-compliant. Start with a familiar SKS platform. Add a high-speed optic and retool the magwell to use a high-capacity double-stack AK magazine. I see. And of course, convert the weapon to full automatic. There we go. Crazy, perhaps, but as a wise man once said, some may never lie, but the crazy never die. Not sure about that one. But... That is, what are our skills before we end? Does anybody have like close combat or she gives us plus one noisy. She gives us plus one zombie threat because she's noisy. Well, that's not great. Morale bonus from an auto shop, but she's a mechanic, so we really need her. She also gives us heal plan. Heal plan? No, meal plan. So hero bonus. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, as always, thank you for bearing with me. Just thank you for putting up with me. You know, I have to, I have to too. I have to put up with myself often, occasionally, sometimes. And uh, I know how hard it is to put up with me. So um, thank you for that. And I hope you'll join me. I'm going to need a lighter load soon. Later. Or some more either State of Decay, some Fallout, or some other stuff that's happening what we need now is on the channel. Clean running water. Okay. Uh, among the other four things you've asked for so far. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me. I hope to see you again soon. Goodbye for now.